the last two final two questions here calculate the amount of work done in transferring a charge of 9 coulomb from a point at potential 5 volt to a point at potential 15 volt so we need to find the work done and uh, what is the charge value it is 9 coulomb and the potentials of initial and final point are 5 volt to 15 volt so what is the potential difference between the two points it is 15 minus 5 that is 10 volt of potential difference so I can do it as V is equal to W by Q we have the formula for potential difference so what is work W is equal to VQ that is what is V we have obtained it as 10 what is Q 9 so it is 90 joule the amount of work done is 90 joule fine the next one the resistance range of electric iron is 5 ohm to 15 ohm iron ko hum pata hai ki uska jo knob hota hai usme ek button hota hai jisko hum rotate karke aur uska resistance value change karke aur heat usme hum increase ya decrease karte hain so let the lowest resistance be 5 ohm and the highest resistance be 15 ohm this is the range na calculate the maximum and minimum current so when the current is maximum when the resistance is minimum and when the current is uh, when the resistance is maximum the current is minimum we know that relation so here uh, we can find definitely find the current the minimum current will be again we, we have to use the formula V is equal to IR in both the cases for maximum current what we'll do we'll take the minimum resistance so V is equal to IR so I is equal to V by R that is in the second case we have the resistance range of a electric iron coil 5 ohm to 15 ohm calculate the maximum minimum current which can be drawn voltage is 120 volt supply so uh, here we know that the electric iron has a button by which by rotating we can change the value of current in that so uh, if the current if the heat amount of heat can be changed by that so and also we know that if the resistance is more the current the amount of current is reduced if the resistance is less current is more so to obtain the maximum current what we will do we will take the minimum resistance so v is equal to i r in both the cases we will have to use the same formula i equal to v by r what is v v is 120 what is r here is 5 so it is 5 2 is a 10 okay and 5 4 is a 20 so it is 24 ohm okay and 24 ampere okay so this is the maximum current and what is the minimum current which it can draw so for that we'll have to use the maximum resistance that is 15 again the same formula i is equal to v by r which is 120 by 15 so it will be around 3 5s are 15 3 4s are 12 so it is 5 8s are 40 how much 8 ampere is the minimum current which it can draw okay so by this we complete our numerical set even if there is some other doubt or any other question if you have you can just uh, write in the comment i can solve it okay Bye.